Aloha, everybody. I'm looking out in the audience, and I'm seeing a lot of young people, people of color, and women. And I just want to say hello, future. And I say future because women are attaining degrees of higher education more than men. They're reinventing industry, and most importantly, they're leading our struggles. If only women voted last election, only seven states would have gone to Donald Trump. Young people, if only young people under 35 voted last election, only two states would have gone to Donald Trump. Change generation. People of color, if only people of color voted last election, which by the way, America would have caught up with Hawaii by the year 2040 and become a minority majority nation. If only people of color voted last election, zero states would have gone to Donald Trump. So take heart in one another. We have the key to the future here in Hawaii. Diversity is the key to the future. So when Trump and Pence comes after DACA or tries to stop the DREAM Act, we will lock arms with our immigrant sisters and brothers. And when Trump and Pence comes after Title IX or try to defund Planned Parenthood men, we will lock arms and follow the lead of the women in our lives. And when Trump and Pence comes after transgendered individuals in the military or the right to marry or incarcerated people or poor communities, we will lock arms with the most vulnerable among us. If they come for one of us, they will have to take all of us. That's solidarity, and that's how we will win the world we want to see.